I have to disagree with you, sir, when I when you say that I'm selfish because feeding my kids is not selfish. These so-called leaders and these so-called judges across the country, you know, arresting moms and dads, and of course she's not the only case. The dad was arrested in Colorado for playing catch with his daughter, a paddleboarder who was paddleboarding alone in the ocean, was chased down by police boats in California. Guy in Florida had to be sent to court because he was trying to sell takeout out of his restaurant. This is happening over and over. And these, again, these so-called leaders, these so-called judges, they need to take a civics lesson. Okay, these laws will not be respected if they are not respectable laws. People are not dumb. They can understand and they can they can assess whether a law makes sense, whether it's really based on data and public health. And a lot of these things aren't, right? We've seen a lot of rules being passed that simply don't make sense. And then it goes, and then they go further. Then they want to actually punish you. They want to use the full force of the law, fine you, throw you in jail, arrest you, take away your freedom just because you're engaging in activity that was previously perfectly legal okay in, in, engaging in a voluntary transaction with another human being has long been a legal and perfectly okay activity and to all of a sudden make it illegal and then use the full force of the law to enforce it that goes against our very basic values listen i'm all for the guidelines okay but the but the government has to use the lightest touch possible and these so-called leaders are not doing that they are they are infringing on people's freedoms all while by the way advocating to allow other criminals who have previously been in jail to be released so it's contradictory in that sense too and, and it's in it's in complete contradiction to our constitution and our way of life and, the, and what our society is founded upon this is why you're seeing people rise up. Americans are sick of it. They have a sense of injustice. They have a sense that these, again, these so-called leaders, these so-called judges, they, they, they have a sense that they're not actually implementing the law because these aren't laws, right? These are executive orders. They have a sense that they're not really implementing justice as we understand it as a culture and as a society. We know that they're, they're doing the wrong thing and we have to call them out for it.